hacking legally since 2015 as help desk. I actually convinced legally? my boss. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I convinced them like, hey, if you let me do pen testing, you know, I'll take this role. But right. my intention was always that. And so he, he was kind of like, haha, this kid. And so he gave me a job. I would give reports and he was just shocked that I was actually doing it. But hey, it was in, it was in legal writing. I was allowed to do it. And so uh, after that, I actually went to DEF CON. I saved up all my money. And that's where I learned about OFSEC. And they actually told me about the certs. And so I spent all my money on OSCP, my tax return, everything, and OSCE. I got both of them the same year. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah. <laughs> and then uh, from there, it ultimately led me to IBM. And, uh, you know, I've, ever since then, I love it. Um, love OFSEC, love what they're doing. I was broke. Like, me and my family, we were, were poor. Like, we were poor, poor. So uh, I had a lot of motivation to do this. Um, and, yeah, I mean, it's, it, I'm, I really do love it, though. I mean, it's not like a... I just learned it to do it, you know, I, I, I do enjoy the job. my mindset was kind of like if I'm a hacker there's no one who can take that away from me so I have to be able to do this even if I'm not getting paid and when I saw OFSEC was hands-on you can't deny hands-on anything and of course man I was already hacking but when I took the OSCP my skills progressed tremendously because these wow. courses are not like oh we're going to teach you one two three it's more like we're going to teach you how to think to find one two three questions I remember that I would get roasted sometimes and I think people need to get roasted sometimes you know be insulted a little bit because it's like asking someone how do I port scan you know have you googled it like I like I hate to say it but a lot of people you know they'll they'll like they'll get into this and they'll be like I want to be a hacker but they haven't even googled how to be a hacker and so it, it's kind of like you can't expect a complete walkthrough on how to do certain things. And so because of the try hard mentality, you go into this broad scope of things you're learning. And you might only use one thing from that broad scope of things you're learning. But because you learn those all those other things, when you get to another subject, they might apply there. And so even though it's a bit like, cause even me, I get angry when I get to try harder. Like it's, even though it's a little bit infuriating, I really do think it forces the student to learn. literally have to you even learn on some of these exams like the OSCE when I took it I literally learned new things during the exam and that's hard to to tell someone who's never taken these certifications because it really is its own experience and again like I've, ne I've t I have taken SAMs and exactly what she says they give you everything up front and so 
you're not, it's kind of weird. It's better, to, in my opinion, it's better to, to teach a mindset than to teach uh, like a pattern to do something, if that makes sense. And I think OFSEC has nailed that.